and I am from uh, Society of Aeronautical Engineers. And uh, here uh, we, uh, what you are seeing is the micro light powered hang glider. What is micro light means it can carry only small weights and uh, powered means it has an engine to give power and hang glider while removing this engine and this fuselage part which is a hang glider with this wing and this upright this is a triangle part which is called upright and with this it is called hang glider you know uh, all of you know about uh, what is glider and what's the use of the glider it can fly from or it can fly without any thrust okay fine now i will explain the parts of this uh, glider this is the nose section and this is the fuselage section or the body section and uh, totally it is it, it is called trike so it has another name called micro light trike trike means tricycle it defines a tricycle it has three wheels and that's why it is called tricycle and here we have a two stroke engine and and a propeller this propeller is made up of composite and here in the top section you have the wing wing of this glider and this wing is made up of a special material called decoron and it is it is very costly and uh, here uh, we see some uh, so many strings attached to the are hooked to the wing and uh, to the upright and uh, other controls or the control six what's the use of this means <coughs> normally aircrafts it fly by i uh, uh, it has a control the control system is by fly by your system what is fly by your system means the aircraft or a glider it will fly only because of this wire system by controlling by means of this wire that's why it is called fly by wire system now i uh, can see th there are two seats one is for pilot if a passenger is flying with the pilot means one is for pilot the pilot will uh, sit at the front and the passenger will be at the back and uh, if a trainee if it is uh, if, if it is fly flying for training purpose means a trainee, uh, a trainee will sit at the front and the pilot will be at the back. So, this triangle section, it is called upright. Uh, it, why it is called upright means it will give up and down motion and also left and right motion. Then, this part is called strut. And the part which connects the upright and the strut is called hung. At the top part. And... Uh, is a 10 mm bolt is connected to uh, a 10 mm bolt is used to connect the wing and the uprights and well coming up here here are the instruments it is used for uh, flying you can see a master switch here a pump switch here and a tachometer and a oil temperature um, uh, indicator airspeed indicator altitude indicator and climb indicator we know airspeed indicator it is used to do indicate the speed of the vehicle and uh, you can see the next to that you can see the altitude indicator or altimeter it is used to do, uh, indicate the uh, indicate which at which height we are flying or uh, uh, from the ground and uh, uh, there next to that you can see the climb indicator or uh, we can uh, we will tell it as vertical speed indicator what's the use of that is it will uh, uh, say the exact uh, uh, speed of the vehicle when it is when the glider is climbing and uh, at the top of the nose you can see a magnetic compass it will uh, indicate the direction of the glider and uh, here at the bottom you can see so many pedals and uh, uh, one more thing here we will provide two pedal two type two controls one for trainee and one for pilot so you can see two pedals one is towards the left and another is on the right. While, uh, the, when, while applying the left pedal, we, we, it will uh, break the supply. And while uh, applying the right, it is called throttle. The right one is called throttle for increasing the speed of the engine. While applying it, the speed get increased. And uh, if, uh, if for uh, taxiing motions or ground motions, if you want to turn to a left, we need to move like this. If you want to turn to the right, we need to move to the right side. So before starting, what we will do means we will uh, put the key inside it, and we will uh, uh, st uh, uh, we will on the master switch, then the pump switch. Then we have a right uh, switch called a magneto switch in the, at the right side. It is used for ignition. After uh, uh, switching on the all switches, we will uh, just start the engine or crank the engine, and the engine uh, the vehicle gets started, and we will uh, fly. <laughs> 